Dozens of people, perhaps you were there, gathering in downtown Buffalo today to shine a spotlight on the number one killer of women heart disease. The Go Red for Women luncheon held today at the Hyatt Regency in downtown Buffalo. This gives survivors and volunteers, along with community and business leaders, the chance to come together and address this serious health threat impacting our region. And a familiar face from here at 7 News at this important event today, our senior reporter Eileen Buckley serving as the MC. And tonight she is giving a voice to some survivors of heart disease, sharing their stories and asking why women often forget to take care of their hearts. And three days later, they told me I had a cardiac arrest and I had to be told what happened to me. Marnetta Malcolm of Buffalo tells me she doesn't remember the few days that followed her cardiac arrest. It all happened just days after the top smash shooting in May of 2022 that for her was literally heartbreaking. And I had never experienced that much stress ever in my life before. And I ignored that, right? Malcolm was honored at Wednesday's Go Red for Women event, but she also honored State Senator Tim Kennedy and two others for performing CPR and saving her life. The night before, I felt a little pain in my chest that I ignored. So I'm trying to find out for you, why do us women forget about taking care of our hearts? And we don't take care of ourselves. And our body gives us signs that we have the stress of the world on our shoulders in between family, life, and we just ignore those signs. I was an active mom of two, a runner, uh, living a healthy lifestyle, so never did I ever expect this to happen to me. I talked with Kelly Nabb of Clarence, who suffered two strokes caused by a hole in her heart. And I think as women, we're caretakers. We don't always put ourselves first, um, but it's so important if you don't feel right or something is wrong. The American Heart Association and leaders of the Go Red for Women event want to empower women to help support each other and watch for any warning signs in your body. We want our women, our friends, our family, our moms, our daughters to be around for a long time. And so we want them to take care of their own heart health and be aware of it so that they can do the amazing things that we know women are doing every day. If something is going on, stop, stop, take care of yourself. Take care of yourselves, listen to your bodies, you know, live, live a healthy lifestyle. Remember that every day is a, is a blessing. Eileen Buckley, 7 News, Buffalo.